welcome to this video. I'm playing a Limerick here. Russia, Russian flag at least. So, looks like an open Sicilian. And, um, okay, Taimanov. Ooh, uh, that's not a line that I like so much. I have to play for a hedgehog now. At least it's an hedgehog where white has moved that knight a couple of times, but my knight on sorry on c6 is also not exactly correct. Hmm. Maybe do it immediately. Reroute that knight to d7. I'm not sure that this leads to much. I mean, he can attack b6 and that's it. Uh, knight a4. Maybe knight a4 was a move there? Hmm. Interesting. Uh, anyway, let's not be too irritated. Knight a4. Hmm. Well, I've got bishop c6, probably some, some something like that. Maybe even bishop d8, yeah. Everything else fails. I can play knight c5 and kick him back, but not sure if I want. I still have that queen b8, bishop d8 style maneuver. That is played there quite often. I'm, I'm going for that. If he takes b6 now, I'm going to take on b6, go d5 for bishop c5. So that's not on at all. Okay, uh, he regrouped that knight, but it's not entirely clear where it is heading. Ah, there. That was the idea. That was the idea. <laughs> okay. Um, so what now? Can I switch to that rook g8 g5 plan? <laughs> I always like that idea. So I, he doesn't mind that. I'm going. I'm going for it. Rook g6, possibly g4. It's an interesting way to complicate the whole thing. Okay, rook g6. He has some good reply now. So maybe start with this. Knight e5 was also also an option, but the opportunity to to arrange the rooks like doubling or rook h7, rook g8, this make this make some sense, I believe. So g4 bishop h6 is not helping me. Let's put that here. See if I can use it on the <clears throat> see if I can use it on the king side. 
okay well I don't mind him if he if he takes it uh, cannot be a big issue I'm thinking a h4 knight h5 things like that yeah that the g5 plan is one of the few active plans that um black has in those hedgehogs um, i mean active in the sense of really that you can do it without reacting to something that white does it's not that black is totally passive it's just quite often the case that um you have to um yeah basically um, um wait what white does and then have then react accordingly okay i was covering b6 i think he probably really threatened to take it so cover that pawn b b4 might be an option i know c4 no, c4 head doesn't hang a4 for a5 Mm. Yeah, and that might be tricky, that move. Maybe not a good idea. Wow, really? F4, knight, okay, F4, knight, G4. Okay, anyway, I will go in the long diagonal here. That That should be right. G6, King G8 would be nice getting out of that diagonal, but okay, that, that's going to explode now any anyway, this whole thing. Um, okay, let's cover, really do that. Yeah, I have G4 at the end of this procedure. Rook d6 maybe, hmm, rook d6, hmm, that threatens rook d8. Okay, knight d7. Um, yeah, knight takes e4, right? Check. No, let's see, he's still attacking that bloody d6 pawn. Mm, how to play rook d6 is immediately threatening on d8 maybe this huh <sighs> covering stuff i didn't see anything much better Ninety two is an issue. Ninety four would be excellent to get in. Mm, I cannot play it now. Check. Takes ninety five. Mm. No, nah, that's probably just good for white if he plays it correctly, but he's really hampered by its time, so down to 10 seconds, something like that. Time warning. Queen f3, no rook takes. Ah, okay. <clears throat> Check. White forfeits. Well, at, one, at one point, he should lose on time if he's on minus something <laughs> all of the time. Um, yeah, a super complicated uh, 
position out of this hedgehog. Let's uh, look at some critical moments. This 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 G5 plan, I'm not sure about, but as I said, it's one of the few um, active ideas that Black has, and it's it, it's often interesting to to play. I think uh, he played that totally okay. H5 and so on. That's it's that's definitely risky business. G3 surprised me. I was thinking that this um, must help me. Yeah, that the long diagonal is so much weakened. The computer wants to go H4 now. That is interesting. Eh? The idea is to take on G3, and after this, um, switch to a dark squared play with A5, Knight C5. It's interesting. Definitely. Yeah, I wanted to use that long diagonal, but it doesn't work. Here, this is the computer reply. And black falls apart. Ha, so I cannot take, and that, that is bad news. <laughs> if I have to play bishop d8 or... Ugh, yeah, so he could have refuted my... My queen a8 with uh, knight d5, h4, however, was okay. So knight d5, this now, it was working again. Again, but it's difficult. And here the position is really um, collapsing quite a bit. Okay, this is a mistake. It seems knight d7 is better. And then take with the bishop on e4, yes, can do that. Hmm. What did you, what did you have? Engine gives king g1, wow. Hmm, yeah, that wins. That position feels shaky for black, really. Yeah? This, this is vulnerable and those rooks are kind of <laughs> very weirdly placed. Check. This, however... Yeah, and now I really have nothing much better than this, but he's better after fe5 or also after that. But okay, he lost some time there. But um, yeah, this is sometimes the problem. If you're sitting in this hedgehog position time and you want to do something, sometimes killing yourself a little bit. Okay, well, thanks for watching.